Okay, 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 hot take time. So, I've been seeing a lot of comments, particularly siding towards the negative side, regarding the Warrior Award for the WWE Hall of Fame this year. So, one of the winners is Titus O'Neil. And the other winner, which is for this year's induction, because Titus O'Neil is a 2020 induction, for this year is this guy. Uh, I'm at cage side seats. And I'm gonna read the, the news. Since this year's Hall of Fame ceremony is also a makeup for last year's being cancelled due to the pandemic, two classes are being inducted. Ready to learn that means two celebrity inductees. Now we know it also means two Warrior Award winners. So, longtime McMahon family employee Rich Herring will receive the award along with previously announced winner Titus O'Neill at the ceremony which taped last week and streams tonight, April 7 at 8 p.m. Eastern on Peacock. All right. I'm glad for George Lucas over here. He won the Wire Award. But there has been some comments recently that are kind of hot takes regarding the Wire Award. Okay? So, let me just find the video. I mean, the picture here. So, former WWE talent JTG of Crime Time actually posted this. Yo, Titus, I'm really happy for you and I'm going to let you finish. But Shad Gaspard should have been the recipient of the 2021 Warrior Award. Okay. What does this mean? It means this poor soul is getting hit. At the moment, because he's not Shad Gaspard, who, by the way, God rest his soul, passed away last year because of being a hero to his son, saving his son from an unfortunate drowning incident. Now, people have got to see that Shad's chances to be in the Warrior Award are still there. They just have to be patient about it. This guy, or Titus, doesn't deserve the heat they are getting because they're not the ones that the majority, or is it the majority? I guess it's a silent minority. I don't know. But it is not the one the social media dictates to win the Warrior Award. Does Shad deserve it? Yes. But Titus and this guy deserves it the same as Shad when it comes to the Warrior Award. The Warrior Award has to be an ex a display of exceptional strength that is reflection of the ultimate warrior. Excuse me. So, if WWE makes their decision we just have to respect it we don't have to bully people because we didn't get what we want and if we didn't get what we want we just take up to the internet and complain and then these poor, poor men harass Shad deserves it I get it Shad Gasser deserves to be in the Warrior Award Hall of Fame in the Hall of Fame, but there's still a chance, guys. We just have to be patient because equally, Titus and Richard here, both in WWE's eyes, deserves to get the award. They deserve to have their moment. Look, he's been working with Vince McMahon for a long time. How 
Sane has this been guy been working for McMahon for a long time. That's exceptional strength. So there. So I want everyone to calm down on their seats. Do not bring heat on the moment. We'll just have to appreciate the Warrior Award recipients because we're lucky that the WWE Hall of Fame isn't just focusing on wrestlers and celebrities but on the normal people. Well, Titus is an exception. He's a dad who kissed his son. Uh, let's not get into that. So there. So the WWE Hall of Fame will be airing tonight, 8 p.m. Pacific Time on the WWE Network or if you're on the US Peacock, let's get the show on the road. Thank you for watching.